Hey guys, what's up? It's Intuition Angel here, getting ready to read for the sign of Taurus right now, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Keep in mind that this is just a general reading, so this may or may not resonate for all Tauruses out there. Check your birth chart if it does not resonate. Um, hit that like button down there for me, please, and thank you if it does. You guys can also follow me on Instagram at roselovetarot underscore, where I post on Wednesdays and Sundays. Um, check your birth chart. Oh yeah, I said that. Um, energies can be reversed. Time is fluid. Personal readings are still the same. My information for that is in the description box below. All right, guys. So let's get some energy for Taurus. Some rising and Venus signs. Hmm. What is going on with Taurus? I feel like a lot of you are getting tempted by someone from your past. Um, it sounds about right because of Mercury retrograde coming around. Um, I feel like a lot of you are just going to be tested. Let's see what's going on. What's going on with Taurus right now? Okay. So we have travel, movement, meeting, adventure. Be ready for new experiences. Yeah. I feel like you're um, moving away from somebody here and you're ready to like face the world by yourself. What else for Taurus? You could also be at a distance from someone here. We have a message. Everywhere I go, I look around as if you'll magically be there. So someone could be traveling around and maybe looking around for your face, Taurus. Or um, maybe they thought that they see seen you somewhere. Maybe they thought they seen you driving. Um, something like that. All I know is that someone is traveling and they're thinking about you right now, Taurus. What else for a Taurus? What is the energy right now? Thank you. We have I don't trust easily. So someone seemed to distance themselves out of um, pure fear. It's like they, um, it's it's like they don't trust. Okay, lessons, knowledge, understanding. Look for the lesson in the situation. Then we also have memories, nostalgia, repetition, attachment. Relive in the past, let it go. This person keeps replaying things back in their head about what they've done to you. I'm getting a, a picture of them, or I'm seeing them like looking out of a window um, as they drive. They could be in the back seat or in the passenger seat and. They're just watching things drive past them and they're thinking about you. They're thinking about the memories. This could also be you doing this uh, right now, Taurus. What else for the sign? Oh, thank you. We have a message. It says, I love spending time with you, enjoying simple pleasures. Yeah, this person's having nostalgia and they're thinking about the times that you guys used to have. Pretty much. Lessons, it gives me a vibe of... Um, I, I feel like you're taking this as a lesson learned here, Taurus. And I also feel like you are um, letting this go. I feel like you're letting this go. I feel like this person still thinks about you, though. What else for Taurus? Summer rising. Thank you. All right, so we have summer here. It's time to see the sunny side. Your answers arrive in the summer. So... Why did it pop up under I don't trust easily? We have a pause here. So like maybe this is a situation where things have to be, um, let me adjust my camera really quick. This is a situation where things have to be um, understand on both sides here. Um, someone has to see the sunny side of the situation, see the bright side of the situation so that they can be able to trust someone here. Something about lessons though, someone had to learn something the hard way I'm hearing. And it's making them see things differently or it will. Clarify, or what's going on with Taurus? Okay. All right, so we have three things. I feel deeply connected to you, but I won't admit it. They still feel connected to you, even though you guys are at a distance. We have self-worth, value, self-esteem, confidence, be empowered by valuing yourself. Then we have runner, escape from emotion and confusion on the run. So I feel like how someone's dealing with, um, someone, someone is definitely um, becoming empowered with their self-worth. They're starting to realize their self-worth and their person sees them as running now. Maybe this was different in the past. It's like as soon as this person figured out their self-worth, they ran. And they took their emotions out of the situation is what I'm getting. Maybe there were emotions in the situation before, but it just didn't work out is what I'm getting. I'm gonna leave these out so I can clarify them. All right. So let's get into it with tarot. You guys like my incense water fountain? If I move, it'll blow away because it's nothing but smoke. Okay. All right. Let's clarify travel for Taurus. 
Why is travel here for Taurus? Okay, I'll take it. So yeah, the Six of Wands here popped out. It was the only card that flipped over out of all of them. Um, I feel like this person wants to get your attention. This person is traveling towards you. This person wants to travel towards you. Everywhere I look, I look as if I'll magically be there. This person um, had you in some sort of toxic situation, some sort of third party, maybe with a Capricorn. doesn't have to be. But I feel like um, they did something to hurt you here. All right. Let's see what's going on. Why is everywhere I go here for Taurus? Thank you. We have the Sun card, and then we have um, the Chariot. So this person does want to have progress with you. They do see, they do see you as making them happy. I still get the travel, the travel vibe with this too. It's like they're coming towards you because they make. They, I I really feel like this person is at a distance from you, Taurus. If you're wondering who exactly I'm talking about, this person is far away, maybe really far away. You know what I mean? And they can't get your attention from far away. I'm hearing different states for some of you. All right. Why is I don't trust easily here for Taurus? Why is I don't trust easily here for Taurus? I don't trust easily for Taurus. I just feel like this is what you're saying to them. Okay, so we have the Knight of Pentacles here, the Page of Cups, and then we have the Ace of Cups here. Someone is, um, I feel like someone does uh, want to bring you an offer with the Page of Cups and the Ace of Cups. I feel like they do see this as a um, something stable. They're not going to pretend like they don't see what this is. You could be dealing with a water sign with Earth in her chart or vice versa. Um, but this person is trying to be patient here with this uh, Knight of Pentacles here. They want things to be right, and they don't want to give something to someone that it's not right. You know, the Knight of Pentacles, he's very, he could be very young-minded, but he's hes all about marriage when he grows up. You know, the Knight of Pentacles. We have the Page of Cups here. Um, yeah, they are going to send you some sort of message because they do see you as an opportunity. You might be their new love for some of you. Clarify lessons here. Why is lessons here for Taurus? Could be dealing with a Cancer or a Leo. Those are the signs that I'm doing next. Okay, so we have um, the Ten of Wands. Yeah, someone had to carry some burdens, maybe, and it taught them a lot and made them stronger. It's like now they're walking away from something that no longer serves them, and they're moving on to commitment. All right, why is the runner here for Taurus? Why is the runner here? Okay, so we have the Five of Pentacles. They feel like you left them out in the cold. I feel like you ran away from them, Taurus. Or maybe this could be reversed. We have the Emperor here. I feel like, oh, and the Empress. Oh. We have the Five of Swords with the, t uh, with the Tower card here. Could be dealing with the Scorpio. Don't have to be, but I'm getting that someone is maybe jealous of this. Someone is shocked by your guys' connection and very conflicted. They can't believe that you guys are together. Someone can't believe that someone is coming together. I don't know why I'm picking up the third party energy, but I am. Someone is shocked that you guys are coming together. Or maybe you're shocked or maybe you're conflicted about it. But you guys are definitely a pair of empress and an emperor just popped out. Why self-worth here for Taurus? Okay, so we have the two of swords here with the three of wands. I feel like you've, okay, the three of, okay. I feel like you're not making a move towards this person because maybe you're trying to heal from something here. And like you're, it's like you're waiting, you're being very patient with it. And it just seems like you're running from them or it just seems like you're leaving them out in the cold. But I really feel like um, this has a lot to do with your, your own self-worth. It's like it... To this person, it seems like you turn your back on them and you're not making a decision the two of swords and the three of wands. So that's just how they feel. Why is memories here for Taurus? Why is memories here for Taurus? I feel like someone, whoever, whoever is the person that, you know, doesn't trust easily, 
they're covering it up with them loving themselves, so. Clarify memories through Taurus. Okay. Five of Swords in the reverse. Maybe someone remembers everything that they've done to you. They're going back, they're playing back everything that they've done and they're not happy with themselves. Four of Cups. Yeah, it's like they're, okay. There is some secret manipulation that they try to do. It could have been emotional manipulation. They've known that they did that. They they know that they, what they've done. I love spending time with you and enjoying simple pleasures for Taurus. This person remembers a time where you did used to wait for him. We have the Eight of Swords here. This person is very stuck in their head. They're stuck in these memories. They're stuck in what they've done to you. Could have been some immaturity going on, but they're still watching you here. Yeah, it's like when they watch you, it's make them it makes them want to commit. And they see something as a different perspective, but they regret things. They regret things that they've done. All right. Time to see the sunny side here for Taurus. Where's the sunny side here for Taurus? Ooh. Remember when I said someone doesn't trust? easily this person is holding back because they don't trust seven of swords seven of swords is you know lying sneaking trying to get away from something or you know get away with something here but i feel like this i feel like this is like it's like gaslighting energy someone doesn't want to be hurt someone doesn't want to be hurt someone wants to wait on something else and maybe they're coming off as i don't trust easily or you should wait for me or something like that like someone is sending that message but it's really that they don't want to get hurt and really they plan on just bringing in a page of cups offer because they're trying to love themselves here. Now that's a different story. For others of you, this person, this person here has woke up to what they've done to you. They, they can't act like they don't see it. All right, let's clarify. I still feel deeply connected to you, but I won't admit it. For Taurus. Okay. Two of Pentacles, it's like they're juggling back and forth. They could be juggling back and forth two different things. They're juggling back and forth this passionate idea. This um, situation with you guys has potential to transform and end um, in a good way, like transformation. But I feel like this person lacks confidence or something like that, or they just play too many games. Let me keep going and clarify this Ace of Wands with the Two of Pentacles, please, for Taurus. Why is the Ace of Wands here with the Two of Pentacles for Taurus? All right, so we have the Nine of Pentacles in reverse. Someone is very non-committal. They're very non-committal. Okay? But I also feel like someone is like, they don't trust. The Moon card and the Three of Swords. Let me do one more thing. Let me clarify this Two of Wands, and then we'll get into what they want to say to you. I mean the Two of Swords, and then we'll get into what they want to say to you. All right. Why is this Two of Swords here for Taurus? Okay, someone, uh, okay, so someone is changing. I think that's you. Yep. You guys are changing and you're starting something new here. Let's get some messages from your person. Divine love messages. I got these on Etsy. All right, let's see. What does this person want to say to Taurus right now? What does this person want to say to Taurus? Okay. So we have, this is not what I want. We are heading to a wrong outcome. We both have to change. Okay. We have be kind and gentle in actions and words. We both deserve it. Okay. We have don't ignore me on purpose. This attitude is not helping. <laughs> And then we have, it. it's time for us to be together. We can rejoice. All right, Taurus, that was your reading. I hope I gave you guys some clarity on your situation. If I did, go ahead and like, subscribe, share to my channel so you don't miss any of my videos. I'll see you guys next week. Thank you. Namaste. Bye.